Hey Prime Coders, welcome back to Prime Coding. I am Aditya and in this particular video, I will be solving your all most frequent doubts. Okay, I get n number of doubts regarding their scores. Okay, I got this much score, how, which role I am qualified for and from the role, I will take you towards the TCS and QT of campus dates. Yes, people, most of the people want to know, I was not able to perform good in this particular TCS and QT free one, how I can uh, perform good in the teachers and QT of campus and when the dates will come please let me know please let me know so in this video I will let you know everything that you want to know and that you should know before the TCS and QT of campus routes so without wasting time when will TCS free and QT will be conducted so this is a very first question and why I wrote in bold because it was asked most of the time so as TCS conducted the on-campus opportunity very quickly like they usually conduct in December, January but they conduct it now so you can totally expect the dates in December or January for off-campus okay so start preparing your aptitude and coding stuffs from now onwards so that you will not spoil this opportunity as well and this is totally free you don't need to pay anything it will be a pan India hiring where everyone is eligible from different colleges okay and now let's move towards the second problem hey prime coding i solved second question seven by seven test cases first coding question grade four by seven aptitude average reasoning 10 questions and advanced sections nine questions okay what can i expect okay he solved one coding question okay second coding question and first coding question okay so second is fully solved and first coding question i would say more than 50 percent has been solved or 60 percent question has been solved so he is like, you can see if you're watching this video, do let me know in the comment section. So you can totally expect for the digital role for sure. Okay, digital is sure for you. And there is chances, okay? There is chances depending upon your shift, how the people performed in your particular shift. So there are chances from Prime as well. Because I, I personally know people who only solved one problem and got very, and they didn't very well in their aptitude and they end up getting the Prime interview call. Okay, so you need to focus for sure. This is the tentative roles that I let you know. So please let me know any doubts if you have in the comment section. Do we have to write optimized code? Are there any constraints? So the optimized code is typically that you should know for every approach, whatever you are approaching, because yes, TCS and QT, all coding problems, coding question has some constraints for sure. Let's say in the second problem, you may get constraints of 10 to the power 4, 10 to the power 5. So if it's 10 to the power 4 or 1000, it can expect or you can expect if it is 1000, you can write O of n square solution. But if it, if, in, but if it is O 10 to the power 4, then you need to write O of n solution. And if it is 10 to the power 5, then it's required log n of solution. So you need to be very thorough with all the complexities and depending upon the constraints. So constraints will definitely be there. Try to write the optimized code if it is possible. Okay. Code could we use HTML functions in our code? So Abhi, yes, you can totally use STL in your whole approaches. Okay. All the approaches to solve both of the problems definitely in upcoming or off campus opportunity you can use or whoever watching from C. You can use STL for sure because TCS compiler supports bits std c dot h. Great, great. So, sir, if a student has got all the test case passed in both the questions, so first of all, congratulations, but not done well in aptitude, both foundation and advanced, will that student be select for second round? Okay, Jenny, I would said I would say is yes, definitely. You can totally expect digital because you solve both of the coding problem, which is a rare thing. Okay, people is not able to solve due to some compiler issue or input errors. So yes, you can expect a digital. If you fairly solve 50% right questions in the uh, aptitude section or 40% right. And if your looks matter and you might solve 60 to 70% right problem, definitely you can expect prime role as well. Okay, so do let me know Jenny, if you have any issues in the comment section. Okay, so master breaker, which is please tell me the code are verified in the background. So firstly, no, it is not verified. If your code passed on the TCS compiler and it shows all the test cases pass, then definitely you gonna clear the coding round and solely depend upon your aptitude corrections. And it is also automated for every question. It is preset in that which option would be the right option. And after your test is finished, 
they accumulate the marks and just end up into the back end okay so because our classmates are just printed through in the code and they have cleared for test cases yeah this could be the situation i also know personally so yes this is a hack although i would say okay if your answer deals with true and false or zero and one you can try to prove return any of one of them try one by one which is giving you more test cases passed so just put it and submit your answer there itself okay but in product based company it do it not usually works because there there has some inbuilt test cases as well and sometimes people do verify their code as well so this is likely to be used but in the worst case you can use now massive success rate in tces guys for sure because we have 90% success rate where most of the people got shortlisted or get selected and got their offer letter for the role that they got selected for yes transform your interview opportunity into the offer letter and make your parents proud because in this particular session the prime experts will take your tcs and qt mock interviews because they know the scenario how will be in your particular interview situation as well so there you can get 1 hour of technical when we test your dbms sql software engineering your coding part your oops and much more and the question based on your resume similarly the hr and managerial for sure so that you will get the whole taste of your actual interview so we'll try to create a full interview simulation and if you talk about resume review we'll let you know all your weak points so that how you can improve your resume and you get stand out into from the crowd okay and the personalized feedback depending totally on your one hour of session what are things that you need to improve where you are lagging and all these stuff all the stuff that you require the road map the guide is the motivation will be given by the expert so for that you just need to head on to www.primecoding.in you will find your cards just have a plan and will meet you in your mock session so that you can crack your upcoming interview opportunity let's move forward with few more problems is python compiler in tcs nqt exam working properly yes it totally work fine okay because i have many candidate who who are able to solve both the problems and they were able to use split they were able to use map they were able to use for loop they were able to take input because there are many many misconceptions that python is not recommended to write on those compiler okay because there is a touch if you if you are from python and you are targeting off campus opportunity you can check how to take input video i created this video in april and april and june that video has good amount of views as well which will definitely help you out how you can take the input in python on rest of the language like c++ and java great and i would say in python what actually happens is it doesn't sense the enter button and the tab button if you pressing tab for indentation purpose it will not sense you will get errors okay instead of pressing tab you should put only two spaces click on space two times and your indentation has been maintained so try to do this particular hack and your all questions will be solved and please don't go on the next line let's say 1 2 is there 3 is there 4 is there so don't go by pressing by using your mouse okay go to the next line by pressing enter great because most of the people okay they write something and they will point their mouse here put tab space they got indentation then they start writing the code again this is not the format okay when you uh, when you end up sort writing your one line after the colon just press the enter so that you will move towards the next line then put two spaces two times and write your whole code that will definitely work okay so first question q is fully solved great but the second one got compiled and got tle okay after successful compilation what may be the problem will i get shortlisted for pi prime or digital or apti was done good great so if you are able to solve one problem and your apti went well then def definitely you can expect a digital role okay digital role interview for sure but the second tle I guess your shift question was prime number, and I don't know how you are end up having that TLE. It may be you are using your brute force approach, but what I will suggest to you is the test case which is given on the TCS compiler. Okay, the test case that you need to pass. The few of the test case or the compilation process does not have the constraint bound, but you submit your code. But on the time of submission, they have. a good constraint level so if your code exceeds or move out of o of n square they will end up throwing up tle which is time limit exceed so 
you need to be very thorough with the optimized approaches as well whatever constraints whatever constraints which mentioned on the uh, question please do follow it and try to write your approach according to that but i guess super coder i told what role that you were going to qualify for if your aptitude actually went well then definitely you can expect for digital core okay so does tcs nqt have sectional cut off or if have please mention them no tcs nqt doesn't have sectional cut off but it's sometime it depends upon the advance okay advance section advance section has something if you are able to solve advance section you are totally eligible for digital or prime offers okay sir i did two coding full and aptitude poor can i expect prime or digital you can expect digital if you are able to perform well 40% right question at least then definitely you can get the digital call or ninja is for sure but the verbal and reasoning okay okay so it is totally acceptable so my exam on 4th of october evening shift so numerical ability okay great 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 so advanced quant poor because 3 out of 4 will be correct coding question both coding question has been passed okay so both has been passed and i guess you did fairly well in your logical reasoning and verbal so you can expect the prime okay but the digital is sure but the digital offer is sure so yes i hope you got the digital role for sure but if your candidates whoever given the exam on the 4th of october evening shift have performed well then you then you can expect the ninja but i would say from my experience from the years or months of experience that i have definitely you can get your digital offer in your hand okay so now if you talk about how to important topics for interview what would be the important topics aditya so crack tcs nqt 2025 because here i am sharing you my 400 hours of experience of this training or mentoring 200 plus candidate who got placed in tcs nqt with the respective roles you will just get it in 60 minute less than 2 rupee per minute less than 2 rupee per minute now it's upon you whether you want to crack the interview or not because i'm not forcing you to take this session but definitely the 400 hours of learning if you get it only in 60 minute when the session would be intuitive will let you know all your problems i will solve your problems and i will also let you know what all important topics that you need to cover for sure which is minimal point that you need to cover okay so less than 2 rupee per minute and a link would be in the description you can find the webinar link okay and we'll meet you on the webinar on sunday 20th october on the 8 pm to 9 pm ist okay so now please join right now we have 25k plus candidates on our telegram group but the thing i want to add here is most of the people who are asking about the gender okay i get to know about the gender now do tcs do uh, gender discrimination or not in interview sometimes it happens sometimes but in the qualification round like after the nqt test there is no gender discrimination if you are able to solve good amount of problem you will definitely get an interview call okay so you need to check that out for sure okay so notes notes interaction network learn and share totally all are the advantages if you join our, our telegram room right away the group link is in the description so please join it share your learnings and get the insights of the other college placements so if you are preparing for tcs and qt 2025 essential or cognizant capgemini or cognizant playlist if you have upcoming communication round or interview or something these resources will definitely help you to crack your coding interviews or full hiring procedure or recruitment trial of any of the service based company so please subscribe the channel if you are new to our channel it takes lot of effort to create this types of content for you like this video if you have not please share with your friends so that your friend can also crack this wonderful opportunities on campus so we'll meet you with a new video soon